And ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to episode 12 of HBWC. And tonight, ladies and gentlemen, we will have the crazy kid going up against Renee Reigns. If he wins, he gets Jason Mayhem for the championship at Superfest, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see if the crazy kid can pull it off and possibly go on Superfest to win the biggest title the company owns. R.I.P. to that nigga won't be missed, ay. I'ma pull up with a bag. I'ma pull up in a jag, ay. I'ma pull up with a bag. I'ma pull up in a jag. My wrist gon' freeze, like what you mean? These hoes on me, I do what I please. Girl, how you know? Gentlemen, Renee Reigns just ambushed the crazy kid. And what the hell? <laughs> yeah, it's your boy taking the Gatorade bottle in. Ladies and gentlemen, here we go. The match is underway. It's a notice qualification match, like we said earlier. Renee Reigns not wasting any time going after the crazy kid, Renee Reigns. One half of the apocalypse with his partner, Jason Mayhem, who he's fighting to defend tonight. And ladies and gentlemen, this match has such high stakes for the crazy kid. This match means so much to him. Jason Mayhem said last week in episode 11.5 that in order for him to get this match tonight, he would have to beat Renee Reigns to get the World Championship match against Jason Mayhem at Superfest. And ladies and gentlemen, this match means so much to the Crazy Kid because they're already one to one. Jason Mayhem beat the Crazy Kid at Zayn Allen's Day Massacre last year to go on to face Clyde, well, Michael Valentine at the time, and then the Crazy Kid, with the help of PJ Rogue at the time, won the YouTube Hardcore title before it was unified against Jason Mayhem the episode before Last Chance and now these two are tied and the rubber match could possibly take place at Superfest if it were to happen ladies and gentlemen between the Crazy Kid and Jason Mayhem that's why the Crazy Kid needs to win this match here tonight but the Crazy Kid is also out to oh man throw Renee Reigns to the cardboard the Crazy Kid is out to prove ladies and gentlemen that he is one of, the, one of the greatest wrestlers back in wrestling he's ever seen. He ought to prove that he's not a joke. That he actually has what it takes to be a world champion. And ladies and gentlemen, it's so tragic because behind the scenes, the crazy kid has always had the short end of the stick. He's never been seen as a main event player. He's always been seen as a mid-carder or a B-level player. He's never been seen as the main, you know, player when it comes to stepping inside the ring and stepping inside those ropes, ladies and gentlemen. So that's why this match means so much to the crazy kid. And he needs to be Renee Reigns to get the Superfest. Oh man, that's objective one. A DDT from Renee Reigns to the Crazy Kid onto the cardboard. And if the Crazy Kid does not win this match, his dreams are going to be crushed. Ladies and gentlemen, he needs to pull out a way to win this match. He can't just be taking damage like he's taking right now. And Renee Reigns, all right, no, he has no chill. Going right after the Crazy Kid. And uh, let's see what we can do here. Oh, God. Oh, man, that huge splash of the Crazy Kid. Good Lord. Oh, my God, ladies and gentlemen. This is the final episode of HBWC before Superfest. And, ladies and gentlemen, Superfest is the main event. Well, not main event. Superfest is the season finale for our brand here. My name is Doug. But Superfest is the season finale for us here at HBWC. And no one really knows what's going to happen with this company after that. But for right now, we're going to focus solely on Superfest and giving you guys the best Superfest we can possibly. And we are teaming up with Mike Johnston and his crew to bring you guys Superfest with NEBW. We're going to have a triple threat match for the world title, for the world championship over there on NEBW, and an open invitation for the new Global Prime title. As well as Daniel Garcia versus that man, Renee Reigns. And Gavin versus Caleb in a grudge match. And, whoa. Oh, oh God. Sorry for that, you know, technical difficulty right there. And here we go. 
and uh oh, and the crazy kid now trying to get Renee Reigns in a triangle hold, sort of. And does he? He doesn't quite have it in. It doesn't really look quite as effective. Dare I say the crazy kid? And and here we go. Oh, Renee Reigns trying to power out of it here. Trying to power out of it. Oh God. And. And the crazy kid needs to get up. The crazy kid needs to stop messing around and, you know, put his foot on the pedal. Because this match is for his opportunity at Superfest. If he does not win, he does not get Jason Mayhem at Superfest. That's what this whole match is for. J the crazy kid needs to, you know, put the aggression, put the aggression on a hold. Go to the forefront and put it all in the line. Because this is what matters here tonight. What matters is going on Superfest. What matters is going to face the world champion for the... Oh, God! What matters is going to Superfest to face the world champion, Jason Mayhem, who's held that title since October. He has not lost it yet. One, two, Renee Reigns kicks out. And the crazy kid can have the opportunity, being the first man to actually beat Jason Mayhem for that YouTube... HBWC, excuse me, YouTube hardcore title. And, don't, and also forget, ladies and gentlemen, don't forget that this will be Jason Mayhem's first singles title defense since King of the Ring, but King of the Ring with a multi-man battle royal. This will be King, Jason Mayhem's first singles title defense if the Crazy Kid were to win this match. And imagine if he were to beat Jason Mayhem in his first singles title defense at Superfest. It would be crazy. The, the, the backyard wrestling world, the backyard wrestling community would be like blowing off their feet. Everyone loves Jason Mayhem and thinks he's one of the best backyard wrestling they've ever seen. So imagine the crazy kid coming in and just, you know, taking the whole world by surprise, getting that huge upset and beating Jason Mayhem. All if he can beat Renee Reigns here tonight. The pressure is on this man, ladies and gentlemen. That's what it's all about. That's why this match means so much right now. And Renee Reigns, what's he looking to do? Oh, God, he's going to... Oh, man, he's trying to knee with the crazy kid counters. Oh, man. And now the crazy kid taking advantage of the moment. Smart strategy there. That's what the crazy kid needs to do. He needs to think smart. He needs to think on his feet. If he wants to go to Superfest to face JC Mayhem. Oh man, thrown to the wall by Rene Reigns. Rene Reigns looking to help his apocalypse buddy. Not slowing anything down. And ladies and gentlemen, Rene knows something about being in the main event or being world champion. Just last year, he faced off against PJ in a ladder match for the HBWC World Championship won not only the first ever ladder match but the first ever World Championship match at Superfest and he's going to Superfest to face Daniel Garcia for a number one contendership at the title and the crazy kid with that huge knee to the face of Renee Reigns oh man the crazy kid starting to show some aggression and the crazy kid actually had the short end of the stick last year at Superfest when he faced Caleb the Unstoppable but he actually beat him though, so I guess he really didn't quite have the shorter than this dick. But anyway, and Renee Reigns now, oh god, with the kick to the crazy kid. And ladies and gentlemen, we've been doing this for three seasons now. Started all the way back in July 2016, and here we are, March 2018. Oh man! With the season finale coming up, Superfest. Superfest 2, the sequel to the first one. It's going to be bigger, badder, better, ladies and gentlemen, and Renee, what the hell is he looking to do? Looking to stack up both boxes. Is he going to... Oh, man. Slowly getting up the crazy kid. And... and whoa, God, I tried to get him up, but his back gave out. And the crazy kid now is going to take advantage. Smart strategy for the crazy kid. No way. Just slamming Renee Reigns on those cardboard boxes and an elbow drop. The crazy kid won. Two, three, and it's over. The crazy kid is going to Superfest. The crazy kid is going to face the world champion. His dreams are on the line at the show. Objective one is completed. Objective two, beat Jason Mayhem and win the HBWC YouTube Hardcore Championship. Have you ever needed toilet paper, Nicket? Were you in the bathroom? 
Try using real nigga toilet paper. Try this little nigga. Dude, I'm taking a shit. Real nigga toilet paper. Wipe your ass like a real nigga. Yo fam, that's like actually kind of suspect, nigga. I think you should chill with that shit, my niggas, nigga. I didn't need it though. Hey, crazy kid. Um, wait. Well, it's been a good, it's been a good match. This match was tying. Renee Reigns put me through hell to that tonight. But one thing. I'm going after you, Jason Mayhem. And not just that, I will put my career on the line for that title. That's how much I want that title. I want it so bad that I'm putting my career on my back for these fans, for the people that want me to win the championship. I'm sick and tired of this corporate bullshit. Let me win that title. And I'm going to be pro I'm proven as super fans that I am the best in the world and I'm walking out of Superfest as the champion. Oh my god, what the hell? The crazy kid, it's, he's putting it all on the line. The pressure is real for the crazy kid. He's done it all in the WC, but he is not, he is yet to win the biggest world championship the company owns. But this time, it's all on for him. He's putting his career on the line. He's just, if he does not win, ladies and gentlemen, then the crazy kid's career is over. They say they've already ended one career of PJ Hero not in ABW. What's going to be next for the crazy kid? And also a super fast, the grudge match. Kale the Unstoppable will go up against Phoenix Wraith, the man who cost him possibly the HBWC Tomorrow World title at King of the Ring. And also going up, we have Bam Garcia versus Renee Reigns and a number one contender for the future of the HBWC World title shot, ladies and gentlemen. That all hangs in the balance. And also we have the Triple Threat match for the NEBW title with the NEBW coming over to collab with HBWC. C Danger, Percy, PJ Hero, who will walk out and become the new or retain the NEBW World Championship. It all goes down at Superfest. And also bringing in the new Global Prime title of the Global Prime Invitational, ladies and gentlemen. Anybody can come out and accept that match. And ladies and gentlemen, Superfest was coming to you guys March 2018. Be on the lookout for that. It will still be uploaded sometime this month. And I am Doug here on the second to last episode of